our people, today we are going to work on our tie-dye main project. So the first thing that you are going to do is flip over your tie-dye name so that you can't see your name very well through the paper towel. So this is the back of the paper towel. Now you are going to get your glue. So these are both the same even though they're in different containers, there's white glue inside both of them. So you don't need to fight over which glue bottle you have because they're the same. So you can open your glue bottle and what you're going to do is you're going to paint the paper towel with glue. So you can go ahead and start painting your paper towel with glue. You might have to tilt it a little bit to get to the glue, to get the glue to touch the brush. So we're not going to pour it, we're just going to get it on our brush. And we keep the bottle close to the brush, so we're not going to put the bottle all the way over here because then when we bring our brush over it might drip onto the table while it travels. So we want to keep the bottle close to the brush at all times. We don't want the brush to have to go really far away from the bottle because that's how we get drips on the table. Smooth it out. That is enough glue. So now you can put your cap back on your bottle and twist it closed like that. Set it down. Now you're going to flip this upside down onto your black paper. And then you can flatten it with your hands. And you don't need to wash your hands. If you got glue on your hands, it's fine. Watch. All you do is you just rub it. Keep rubbing it. And see how it made a little glue line or a little glue ball? It will be kind of gray. So you just go like that. And then it falls off. So any little glue spots, you just rub. And then it comes right off. Okay. So you're good to go. Okay. Now you are going to take your white that I've given you. This is called oil pastel. So it's kind of like a crayon, but a little different. So say oil pastel. Good, oil pastel, good. That's what this is. So we are going to draw a frame now around our artwork. Here are some different ideas for lines that you can draw around your artwork for the frame. Um, I'll just set this right here. So you can copy any of these lines or you can come up with your own line or your own design. You can do smileys, hearts, whatever you want. I'm going to do this one. So you can go ahead and start. And now you can add more decorations to your frame. Whatever decorations you want. I'm doing circles. You can add more decorations. If you need to flip it so you can reach better, 
if you can. And that is it for this project. Good job, you guys. I'm gonna, this is a little wet. Like the glue comes through the paper towel a little bit. So you guys aren't gonna take this home today. I'm gonna hold on to it for you. And I'll give it to you next week to take home because next week it will be all dry. So it'll stay in the art room to dry. And then I'll give it to you next time if this, if the glue is dry. Cause the glue came through the paper towel a little bit. Okay. All right, great job everybody.